This is for Aquarius, so I'm rising the Venus signs. This is for Aquarius. My name is the Reader to Me, and I was here for those of y'all that are new. And welcome to the Mean Isle channel, y'all. Let's see what's coming in for Aquarius right now. But I appreciate y'all and thank y'all so much. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment to everybody. I appreciate you. And if you are interested in personal services, you can check out the description below or email if you're on YouTube. If you're on TikTok, you can just go directly through the booking link or you can inbox. Let's see what's coming in. So we got come together and we also have light. So we have the fairy queen of the light comes to shed love and light onto your current situation and to remind you that light can penetrate the darkness. And we also got come together. So we got fairies like to be busy and group them as they show that many hands may make light work. Working as a team helps get the job done. And we also got celebration. So we got to get ready to celebrate let your hair down and celebrate. It's time to go out and dance, play. An invitation could be on the way. And we also have motivation. So we have when your spring approaches, like flower fairies urge you to spring into action. If there's something you've been merely thinking about doing, then they say get busy and do it. So this is having the motivation to go out the goal for a lot of my Aquarius. This is the universe telling you like, hey, this is your time to go after what you're wanting. So there's no more holding back. The universe is telling you to go ahead and take that leap now. And we got music and we also have temptation. So we have listen carefully for there may be a message in the music you hear. Music can lift your soul and rekindle your memories and charm fairies to your door. And we have are you in denial about an unhealthy habit, perhaps one that makes you feel guilty? The fairy, the fairy says you have the power to overcome temptation, whatever is disguised. So things might not appear the way they seem, Aquarius. Be careful. We got protection. It's like you have a spirit God trying to protect you right now from someone or from a situation. So don't be no fool. Don't be no fool, Aquarius. What else is coming in for Aquarius right now? So we have purity and we also have nature's sun. So we have allow always trust in the purity of your heart. Look inside of your heart within and you will find all the answers to your questions in nature's sun. So we have be repetitive to subtitle messages as nature comes about your day. What else is coming in for Aquarius right now? So we have find a balance, a little bit of Libra energy here today. Your match is going to be Libra. We got find a balance between your work, your rest, and your playtime. You have more energy, harmony, and productivity in your day. Take a power nap. And at the bottom of the deck, we got journey. So a lot of y'all are going to be going on a journey very soon. For some of y'all, this is spiritual. For some of y'all, this is mental. And then for some of y'all, this is just receiving that clarity that you feel like you've been losing or that you just haven't been receiving. I hope y'all can hear me better because we had a lot of people in the comments swearing I was yelling, y'all. So we got a microphone now. <laughs> What's going on, y'all? What's going on? I appreciate y'all. Let's see what else is coming in for Aquarius right now. And please do not forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment. So we have saving and no more complaining. As you consistently save for your future, your future is being saved. You do your future self a big favor by consistently setting aside present funds. This is a part of your self-care and path to feeling secure and focusing upon your life. And we also have complaints and our affirmations of victimhood, which is never truly spiritual. Take back your God-given power by affirming what you have and abundance of choices and freedom. With your increased confidence and assertiveness, watch these positive affirmations turn into reality. So this is the power of the tongue. This is going back to the power of the tongue, Aquarius. You are what you speak and you are what you put out into the universe. So if you are wanting certain energies, then you got to make sure you put that out. And that's the only way you're going to receive it. And we also have take a divinely guided chance and gratitude list. So we have all po positive change and successful ventures involve a degree of risk. You are now ready to follow divine goddess to new territories as you leave behind, which is comfortable and familiar, but no longer appropriate for you. And we also got gratitude lists. So we got count your blessings of feeling gratitude for you already have what helps you, you know, center, you know, fixate on your heart. They're basically telling you quit worrying about what you don't got. That's the problem with a lot of y'all. Oh, you know, y'all ever heard this on all something about what you got? Girl, you know that you need to stop. I'll try to figure out who sing that song. 
Was that Jay Sean? Who sung that? That was a little throwback, but that was the first thing that came to my mind because somebody is always talking about what they got. I don't know if this is you or them. So just keep that in mind as well. Let's see what else is coming in for Aquarius at this moment. So we have visualized abundance in all forms. God gave you such a spiritual power that everything that you visualize eventually becomes reality. Hold a vision of which beautiful, helpful, and positive filled with blessings. <clears throat> Excuse me, y'all. <clears throat> and we also got de detox your friendships. So your abundance flow is being affected by the people whom you're spending time with. So be discerning about your associates and your relationships and choose to be with people who are inspiring, generous, and supportive. Come on. Get rid of them toxic people. I had to. I'm telling you, I if I felt like you were toxic even a little bit, I don't speak to you. And there's some people that I do love that do have toxic ways, but I've learned to love them from a distance. I don't got to sit on the phone with them. I don't have to make plans with them. I don't have to go out with them. I don't need them in my business. And I keep it that way. And we also got focus on your priorities. Where you put your focus is where you ultimately receive your outcome. Your priorities are calling to you, which may produce a feeling of anxiety unless you give them all the small amount of attention that they deserve and desire. So this is focusing on your goals for a lot of my Aquariuses as well. Let's see what else is coming in for Aquarius, y'all. My name is D-Reader to me and I was here for those of y'all that are new. And welcome to the Mean All channel, y'all. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. So we have chemistry, we got some Taurus energy, somebody got a three-year-old, and somebody got a nine-year-old, we got some Leo energy. So for a lot of y'all, you could be dealing with a Taurus or a Leo, there's a lot of chemistry here, but somebody does have a third party. So let's just go ahead and shoot that confirmation out there. Yes, somebody does have a third party. Um, there's a lot of attraction here. Somebody could be 25, especially if you're dealing with a Gemini. But it looks like somebody feels like a choice or an option. I don't know if this is you. I don't know if this is them. But somebody feels like a choice. This could be an Aries. Some of you are going to be sitting down with an Aries or a Gemini and pretty much let them know like, hey, I don't play the other woman. I don't play the other man. I don't play second best. I'm number one or the only one. New, more, new you know, that's pretty much how that's going to go. And somebody could be 30. There's a lot of sexual energy there. As you see, he's, you know, giving her pleasure on the card. Um, glad these are paintings or I wouldn't be able to show these. Um, and yes, if you're dealing with a Sagittarius, this is a trial period. So it's very temporary. I appreciate you, Aquarius. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment, y'all. At the bottom of the deck, we do have freedom. So you're going to be walking away from a Sagittarius. Some of you, this could be an Aries. And then for some of you, this could be a Gemini. I appreciate you. Thank you.